Hello everyone. So guys, Karnataka 2023 exam uh, now tomorrow that is on 13th of January 2024 it is going to happen. After multiple uh, postponement now the exam is going to happen tomorrow finally. So initially they have stated that it will now it was in November to uh, 26. Previously it was in October later November later now uh, to the December 31st and now it is 30, uh, 13th of January 2024 that is Saturday tomorrow it is going to happen. So the guidelines before going for the exam and last minute tips please listen to this video 10 minutes or below 10 minutes only it will be there. Mainly Karnataka Kannada aspirants must listen to this video whether you belong to paper or paper to anything this is a common to all which you need to follow in your exam to qualify without any trouble. Because paper will be always liberal and paper will be always normal only. You will overthink it. Please don't commit the mistake which I am going to tell you now. So let's look at uh, the guidelines for the examination day. That is for tomorrow. They have given clear cut guidelines. It is in Canada but still we can able to understand. Here 13th of January 2024 paper 1. First uh, they are going to take the exam in two, two slots. Paper 1 and they will give the break and la uh, later paper 2. This is advantage to you guys because net exam is entire 3 hours continuously. But here 1 hour time gap is there. Morning 10 o'clock to 11 o'clock paper 1 50 questions 100 uh, marks and uh, 1 hour time. 1 hour time 50 questions 100 marks will be there. Right. So uh, this is uh, guidelines before the 9.30 you have to go into the uh, examination hall. And uh, 10 to 10, uh, 10 to 11 o'clock exam is going to be there and there is no negative marking. There is no negative marking. Here if you look at paper 2 timing is 12 o'clock. 1 hour break will be there. 10 to 11 paper 1 and 11 to 12 break. Now 12 o'clock to 2 o'clock which will be uh, proper timing. Actually after 2 o'clock you can take the lunch. If they are going to keep after uh, afternoon uh, then it will be a trouble to you because you will have the lunch. And again sitting for the examination is difficult to read the question. So your paper to 12 o'clock to 2 o'clock it is going to be there. Right for this you need to go into the exam hall uh, at 11.30 around. The timing which is mentioned is 11.30 and ending is 11.45 is the closing time. Starting is uh, 11.30 and ending is 11.45. There also 9.30 to 9.45 they will make you to enter into the examination hall. Right. So. This way, this is going to be offline exam only because they mentioned about the OMR here. So OMR is uh, clearly mentioned. So it will be maximum offline exam. And uh, what are the things that you need to remember, sir? First of all, this is a set exam. You have prepared a maximum for the UGC net exam also. Mainly those aspirants who appeared for our courses, mainly Arjuna course. Arjuna crash course as well as Arjuna revision course 20 days course also some people have taken. So I hope you completed the course for the paper one majorly and paper two commerce people also completed your course. So in this whatever you studied is going to be revealed or it is going to get the result tomorrow. You have to show your performance in tomorrow. While reading the questions read it carefully. If you get doubt in English version try to Confirm with a Kannada version. Second, try to solve the reading comprehension first. Later, data interpretation. Always I am telling you same thing in UGC and also. Solve the reading comprehension first because five questions, pakka 10 marks. Mind will be fresh in the beginning. Solve that questions. Later, second one is that try to solve the data interpretation questions. Because having 60 minutes only. Don't waste much time on difficult topics or difficult questions. Try to solve the easy questions which you can able to attempt for the first click itself. Then later you can solve that difficult question within the 60 minutes. 60 minutes will complete just like one minute only because you will feel like time is not there. Even when the three hours time continuously is there you will have a time saving option. You can compare with a paper one paper two and you can jump here and there here and there. But here. No option. Only 60 minutes is available for your paper one. So 13th of January 2024. Tomorrow it is going to happen 10 to 11 o'clock. Remember don't eat heavy uh, uh, oil food in the morning because morning only session is going to happen exam session. Go with the exam hall with a light food. So 10 o'clock take the exam till the 11 o'clock. Make the time management properly. And whenever you are attempting paper one question now. After attempting RC and DI. 
then try to go with the questions whichever is easy for you try to keep on attempting fast and whichever is at least a 10 to 20 percent doubt is there keep them for a last but because you need to speed up your attempting number of questions at a least time then later whichever is doubt for you you keep them on hold identify the keyword suppose there is a research related question identify manipulation is a word related to experimental research and improvement is a word related to action research because very small small questions will be there and in evaluation systems also in teaching aptitude formative summative main main topic try to revise i hope you have you must have been revised uh, already so main main topics which are damn sure areas like in teaching aptitude we can say pakka questions from factors affecting evaluation system that is formative summative normative and the norm reference testing criteria referenced these are all regular questions like that in each and every area regular questions are there so i'm sure they will ask the question from that area so do not ignore those areas right and uh, always try to find out the rc if it is at the end click on the uh, if it is as it is offline exam you will have an option you can see where it is available so turn the sheets it will be there and uh, there only try to answer the questions first rc questions right so don't waste unnecessary time and don't apply your common sense. Don't apply your common sense because you will study a lot. Finally, after going into the exam, you will apply your logic. You will apply your own logic, your own common sense. No, please stop your mind in thinking about the common sense. Think the question in a conceptual perspective. Think the question in a conceptual perspective. Identify the meaning of the one term in the entire question so that answer will get relief in mathematical aptitude question if you are not getting an answer properly then try to check with options first then look at the question again option verification will give you will save a lot of time because showing your knowledge is not important there showing your showing your marks correct answer is important this is not a descriptive examination and moreover, in the mathematical aptitude, number series, alphabet series question will come now. The moment that uh, they give you uh, the rough sheet, if they are going to give you the rough sheet now, on that itself, try to write immediately. On that rough sheet itself, try to write immediately A, B, C, D, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, M. Then write the from N to Z also in reverse. Give them numbers. So that one number series or alphabet series whichever question comes it will be easy for you to identify the logic behind that question two marks completed without any efforts within one minute you can solve that question if you have written in advance this is a cheat code so without starting exam how can you write the alphabet you can write they'll give you the rough sheet now you can write don't show to them right so small small things paper two paper one whenever you are attempting read the question thoroughly link with the options don't read the question again and again first time if you are not getting the question then read the option later read the question in the second time right and uh, here don't uh, over excited for the easy question suppose some known question which you already solved in the class might have been appeared UGC net question copy paste. Hold on for a second. Read the question. Is it that question or not? Check twice before you are marking on the OMR because whenever you are marked now, once you are marked, you cannot take back. It's offline exam. So be very careful in dealing with that. Right? And after the exam, please do inform me how was your exam, how was your question paper. Please do send me your question paper of paper one and paper two, commerce and paper two, any other subject also. So that we will make a review and how many questions you are correct, how many questions you are wrong, then we can able to tell with a provisional answer key once they give. Right? We will solve that question also in this YouTube channel. So do not forget to subscribe to this channel and please do hit a like button, share with your friends. And after the exam, now if you want to prepare for UGC net June 2024 examination, paper one and paper two commerce batch is starting. So, paper one and paper two commerce just at a 6199 with a six months validity, lowest price in India. You will get a live classes if you miss the live. Recording will be there. Well prepared PDF material, detailed version of PDF material for the paper one and paper two commerce all will be there. Previous year question classes and their PDF material. Subtopic wise quizzes with explanation will be there. 
total each and every topic quiz and their explanation and nta based cbt mock test plenty of mocks are going to be there in this youtube channel only many uh, videos are available and uh, number of demos are available if you like them and please do watch them if you didn't watch and after that only decide to one single course one lakshya batch which is jrf resources complete all your jrf resource under one plot give your invest your six months trust the journey trust the platform trust your educator be consistent in classes and uh, preparation practice also then your jrf is our responsibility damn sure we will keep that so if you have any doubt regarding this if you want only one paper paper one then three five double nine for entire six months if you want only paper two also same price three five double nine will be there right if you want both papers three uh, six one double nine will be there right please do subscribe to this channel and subscribe to the course course link is available in the description go with the course right thank you so much have a great day and all the very best to all the case at aspirant may you come out of the exam hall with a smile that is i'm going to qualify for the case set not with a sarcastic smile smile with a confidence of qualifying the exam right all the very best thank you so much